days. Underestimate as much as 500,000 people on the busiest day. The 2012 Soto Outdoor Media Survey estimated 1.5 million pedestrians per week. Koya is also one of the Hollywood location for movies such as the Fast and the Furious Talk Show Drift, Alice in Borderland, and The Resident Evil Afterlife, as well as the domestic and international news broadcast, the iconic video screen featured in the above film, in particular lost in translation with its walking dinosaur. Scene was taken down for a period of time and replaced with static advertisement through its resumed operation in July 2013. Contemporary British painter Carl Randall who spent 10 years of living in Tokyo as an artist, depicted the area in his large artwork Shibuya exhibited at the National Portrait Gallery in London on 2013. So that's Shibuya. Uh, here we go again. The people are crossing. So this is estimated of 3,000 people crossing at the same time. Like seeing these people crossing is amazing. It's insane. So this uh, Shibuya sky. That's the building. That was the Mario Kart that I was talking about. <laughs> they just passed by. Look at the insane amount of people crossing by this Shibuya station. Shibuya crossing. I was really disappointed that because uh, the Starbucks there it's under renovation. It's so fun! Tourists for a day. Like everyone is just crossing and crossing and crossing. Going back to the vlog. <laughs> Look at that. Someone is endorsing Trump 2024. I'm really enjoying the weather right now. where the Starbucks located but as of now I think it was under renovation like it's insane like people are just crossing by this busy okay it's time
So it's where we went before and then everyone is just crazy about here. So this is gonna be the last lap that I'm going to do. Then after that, I'm going to have a, a Walter vlog here in Shibuya. Here in Tokyo for Halloween. Just there, just there. Yeah. 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 I'm gonna have a, a quick lap here in Shibuya. As you can see guys, there's so uh, many tourists here, foreigner and local. I think it's because this is one of the most popular ones, that is why. I messaged my partner that I'm already here, so nothing to worry about. For now, I'm really enjoying the vibe, like the spirit, the people here, and the weather is comfortable enough to walk. Yeah. So enjoy the video, guys. So this is also one of the shopping districts here, so if you want to check it out, they have different kind of business establishments such as uh, ABC Mart, they also have uh, Family Mart and other business establishments for souvenirs, like the authentic Japanese uh, ramen, and also they have a Shibuya Gai Tonkatsu ramen, uh, like that. So the prices is uh, like around 1,130 to 1,630. I am pretty warm at the moment and I'm sweating as, as, oh my god, it's so sweating. The weather is crazy but I'm really enjoying today. I have a, a break for uh, being in Yokohama alone. This is a really good spot for me to do a vlog. So we're gonna go for uh, over there, which is the GU. I am going to message my partner first here in McDonald's. To be honest guys, all of the spots here in Tokyo, they are all Instagrammable.
and we're back doing a vlog here in Shibuya. The temperature here is 19 degrees and I really love it. Teka. Like this area has a lot of restaurants. Uh, they also have Mega Don Quixote if you want to need more of the chocolates present for your loved ones if you're gonna go back home. So we had a, a, a right turn here just to see the places here. So unfortunately since